We're following new details tonight in the legal battle that is brewing against Deshaun Watson. Multiple women have accused the Texans quarterback of sexual misconduct. Now attorneys from both sides are revealing new details about where the lawsuit stands. KPRC 2's Courtney Zabowski live for us now with an update you will see only on two. Courtney? Chris and Lauren, we have been in touch today with both Rusty Harden and Tony Busby to see where things are. As you've probably noticed, things have been unusually quiet for the last few weeks when it comes to the 22 civil lawsuits filed against Houston Texans quarterback Deshaun Watson. Is a settlement in the works? That's the biggest question I've been getting. But according to the attorneys, no, no settlement. Tony Busby, the attorney for the plaintiffs, is saying that that's not for a lack of trying. Tony Busby says there was an effort, but now he says that is not going to happen. These cases are moving forward. Busby also told us that four of his plaintiffs have spoken with the NFL for its investigation. He's on the fence, though, if he'll allow more of his clients to speak with the NFL because he says investigators did not treat the women the way they should have been treated. Also, Monday, discovery is set to begin in this case, and while the official dates of depositions have not been set, Tony Busby says he plans to take Deshaun Watson's deposition for a total of 50 hours, plans to depose him on background and then spend two hours per civil lawsuit deposing Deshaun Watson. Also, Rusty Harden just released a statement and he said that Busby approached him several times about a settlement, but there will be no settlement unless the terms are made public and all participants are allowed to speak in their own defense at all times. Meanwhile, the Houston Police Department is still conducting its investigation. Reporting live, Courtney Zabowski, KPRC 2 News. Keep us